It's that time of year again, when classic car lovers emerge from the darkness to shed light on their beloved antiques in the Chevy Woodward Dream Cruise. This year marks the 17th year classic cars will cruise the streets from Pontiac to Ferndale. To this day, it continues to be the largest automotive event, drawing in more than 1.5 million people. Some argue it's all about the power under the hood, and when muscle cars ruled the streets of Motown, a time when poodle skirts were fashionable and rock and roll could be tuned in on any radio station. But this stroll down Woodward is more than that for Air Force veteran Greg Earl. Greg owns a 1957 Chevy 210 Series two-door station wagon that he built from the ground up, cutting the car in half. These 210s were, were used by uh, tradesmen, like electricians and plumbers back in the day. So in itself it's a rarity and then, uh, well, I, I what they called back half the car, cut the frame off just behind the front seat, put in a different frame, narrower so I could put these big tires that are on the car. Lots of modifications, it just made it more my hot rod. He's been coming to the Dream Cruise since it was established in 1995. Well, if you're, if you're a car guy, it's like the, uh, the mecca of the car world, I mean, it, and uh, the special thing is the cars, the second special is the people. You know, I've met people from Europe and Scandinavia, Australia, everywhere. It's just, it's just a remarkable event for, for car people. It takes a bit of a time to, to clean it up and get all the dust off of it. But I usually try and put a nice uh, finishing wax on it before a show. And the cleaning and waxing pays off. Greg has won dozens of awards, ranging from trophies for best in-show automobile to plaques honoring veterans with classics. Though awards aren't handed out at the Chevy Dream Cruise, Greg has no doubt that his classic beauty is one of the best. In White Lake, I'm Ashley Raymond, 7 Action News. See you in